YouTube, what is up? This is Garrett, and this is Garrett Brown Art Studios. If this is your first time to my channel, welcome. If you're coming back for more, hey, it's good to see y'all. <laughs> so today we are still in our swipe series, and today we are doing a swipe with metallic paints only. So thankful and grateful for you guys spending a few minutes to paint with me, and I hope that you enjoy my content. If you do, there is a like and subscribe button below. Go ahead and press it. So today, we are using all deco art. Yes, we're swiping with deco art exclusively today. The paints that we're using are from the Dazzling Metallics line and the Extreme Sheen line. I don't think that there's a difference in this paint. I think there's just a there was a branding change with Deco Art. All of these colors have been mixed with our pouring medium, and that recipe is going to be listed um, in the description box below. Now we're preparing our white color, which is Amsterdam Titanium White and Australian Floetrol. Wow, check out those cells. It's like they are just forming without any problems. Oh, I'm loving the colors and how they're mixing together. So the reactions were very, very nice. Um, there definitely may be some things going on in the metallic paints that are causing a really nice reaction. As you can see, we got lacing, we got cells, we have ghost cells, and they're all so compact to each other. I'm really just loving this. All right, so here are a couple close ups for your viewing pleasure. Um, this piece dried wonderfully. It dried just as you see it here. Um, the cells are just bonkers. And we're going to transition to our next pour, which is a bloom. Yes, I decided to go ahead and do a bloom with the same paints so that you could see what happened.
as I blow, I find that I lose, or it appears that I'm losing some of my titanium white. So this tip is more of a trial and error thing, and maybe it's something you guys would like to do. Um, I'm going to try and mix in some zinc white with my titanium white when I am doing blooms uh, with metallic paints because the zinc is going to be a lighter weight. So I'm thinking, you know, as long as I have some of the metallic paint in there, um, excuse me, as long as I have some of the titanium white in there with the zinc, it should help it float better on top of the metallic paints, which are naturally heavier than regular paints. Everything that I'm learning with swipes, I believe that it's definitely worth a try to experiment mixing different cell activators to work with metallic paints. I don't think there's a one-all, end-all type of thing when it comes to doing a bloom. Um, when I get to focusing on blooms, I'll see if I can digest that and report back to you guys as well. Okay, these are the paints that I use today. Um, if I could leave with anything, I realize that metallic banks are very forgiving in the swipe. Um, your ratios can be off and you're still going to get some really cool effects. With blooms, it's a little bit different. I think the metallic paints are very finicky, so it may require testing a bunch of different recipes um, to see what you like. So this is the end result and we're going to wrap this video up. Uh, remember to do everything with love and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Peace.